Um, listen, these numbers that we're, gonna about to, we're about to tell you about are staggering. One in three people who die by firearm in Cuyahoga County committed suicide. The Academy of Medicine of Cleveland and Northern Ohio is encouraging physicians to do their part by advocating gun safety, especially to parents. Senior health correspondent Monica Robbins explains. It's no surprise that guns are the number one method of suicide in Ohio, but the risk to kids is even greater. So unfortunately, firearms uh, have become the number one leading cause of death in our children and our teenagers. You know, far exceeds motor vehicle accidents and anything else. According to the Ohio chapter of the American Academy of Pediatrics, 50% of suicide survivors made the attempt within 20 minutes of their decision. Unsupervised youth access to firearms triples the risk of death by suicide. And 82% of kids who died by suicide used a gun from their home. The Store It Safe program started in 2015 to address the problem. It's not about taking guns away. It's preventing kids from getting access. The vast majority of parents who own guns are certainly law-abiding, want to keep the guns out of the hands of their children. They may not have the means to get a lockbox. And part of this program is to teach them how to store their guns safely and also provide them with a lockbox. The Academy of Medicine of Cleveland and Northern Ohio donated $35,000 to the SIS effort, but also started their own gun safety coalition. Next year, the Store It Safe program will be in family practice offices in Northeast Ohio. Uh, so we will also be offering webinars for physicians so that they can have that conversation with the patient, again, in, in a depoliticized environment. Now, the Gun Safety Coalition brings in trauma surgeons, hospitals, police and community organizations, all looking to decrease gun violence in our region. And they say by joining efforts, they hope to reach more people and make a bigger difference. Okay, important work. Monica, thank you.